Fisher Price's Rock and Play Sleeper is a popular product, and this morning you can still buy it at most major retailers. But the American Academy of Pediatrics is calling for its immediate recall, citing the product's ties to at least 32 infant deaths. Joining us now are Keenan and Evan Overton. Their five-month-old son, Ezra, died a little more than a year ago while he slept in a rock and play sleeper. Guys, we are so, so sorry for your loss. Your story is every parent's nightmare. And we so appreciate that despite your grieving, you are coming on to try to warn other parents. And so, Keenan, can you tell us what makes you think that it was the rock and play sleeper that killed Ezra? Uh, there, there's no doubt in my mind. Ezra was very strong and healthy and everything was normal with him. Um, after after we found him in the chair, we just did our research and looked up the chair and the angle, and it, it's just it's just appalling that there was a lack of research done by Fisher Price yeah. and about having babies sleep in such an angle. Um, it, it can jeopardize their breathing and just scientifically it's, it's not safe and it's not a safe design just to let people know the story you were asleep nearby on a sofa nearby and when you woke up your son had turned somehow in this sleeper thereby suffocating yes he had turned into the cloth of the seating um i was in the living room i it was i was going to take over that that night and give evan a rest and I had him right by me in the living room by the couch. And um, when I woke up, he had already turned into the seat and passed away. Mm -hmm. Evan, tragically, you both are not alone. Um, the American uh, Academy of Pediatrics believes that there are dozens of parents in your situation. Let me read their statement to you. The American Academy of Pediatrics calls on the U.S. Consumer Product Safety Commission to issue an immediate recall for the Fisher Price Rock and Play Sleeper, which has been tied to 32 sleep-related infant deaths, according to a new analysis by Consumer Reports. Evan, what do you want Fisher Price to do today? I want Fisher Price to just immediately take it off the shelves. I mean, one baby is enough, but add on 30 and plus that, it's just outstanding that it's still being sold. I just really want them to take into account all of the parents' stories and all the families who are grieving and just save other people's heartache and just remove it immediately. That's the best thing. Here is the Fisher Price statement they gave to us. I will read it in part um, because it's too long. Uh, they say the safety of our children is our highest priority. The loss of a child is tragic and heartbreaking. We stand by the safety of the rock and play sleeper. The product meets all applicable safety standards, including those of the International Standards Association. We continue to work closely with the Consumer Product Safety Commission regarding the safe use of our product, including the rock and play sleeper. It is essential the product warnings and instructions are also followed. What do you think when you both hear that statement today? Honestly, it just makes me feel as though the parents are being disregarded and that their pain isn't insurmountable um, by the loss of a child. If they stand by safety and these seats have been shown to not be safe for children, why still sell it? It doesn't make any sense to me, uh, especially if there are other recommendations to also take the chair off the market as soon as possible by actual doctors. That's what we need to be listening to. Yeah, it's so frustrating to see the, the blame placed on the parents who've lost their bundles of joy, their whole future, their whole life and parenthood. And they're putting it on a label that wasn't visible on the chair that we had. It's, it's insane and it's infuriating to say that this chair is safe when it's clearly not. And one baby's loss should be enough, but this is just insane. We, we, we feel so devastated right now. Well, we do too, and we understand your devastation, and we so appreciate your efforts to try to save other parents from going through the heartbreak that you are going through. Thank you very much. We will stay in touch with you as we see what Fisher-Price does. Thank you both. Thank you. Thank you.